So I got the uh, FJ Dynamics auto steering kit in the mail the other day and we mainly got this for doing tillage in the spring and fall but since it's summertime and I want to try it out we're going to be putting on the 4440 on the uh, MoCo see how that works out but uh, I haven't looked through any of the boxes yet I obviously have them open because for video sake it's easier just to cut them open so I think this one is the main main box here so we'll flip that open looks like we got our book here zip ties and some other hardware which we're gonna have to figure out later where that goes some more paperwork and a sticker put that here Well, there's the main parts. So it looks like here we got the monitor screen. Decent size actually, bigger than I thought it was gonna be. But yeah, there's that. There's a steering wheel cover. Pop this out of here. There's definitely some weight there. But um, it does have the steering motor on there, so of course it's going to weigh. See how this works is you take your steering wheel off. So I'm going to take the steering wheel off to 4440. And this one, I believe, is the sleeves. I've seen the picture here. Yeah, there's different sleeves for different types of splines on whatever tractor you might have. There's quite a few of them in here some other mounting hardware but <clears throat> so i'll have to find the right sleeve for that tractor and then you put this wheel on at first i didn't know what to think about replacing the wheel but after getting my hands on it it don't seem like that bad of a wheel it's kind of soft has some give to it but hmm. looks like we got some more wiring here Antennas, more wires. I don't think there's anything on the lower layer, but so that little box is all the sleeves and some other hardware. This box, I would assume, are the uh, globes. Yeah, it looks like it. So this one has. Two globes, at least that's what I call it. I don't know their technical name on it. And then it has two antennas. So we got some wiring harnesses, some more wiring harnesses, antenna. We'll figure out what that is. There should be a uh, a wheel angle sensor in here too somewhere that I'm gonna have to put on. Somewhere there's some globes. I don't. Maybe it's in the other box. Maybe it's in this one. But. All kinds of wiring. I'm assuming these are the brackets for everything. It comes with that bracket, which I'll bolt on the cab. And in my installation video, we'll look into that more. Huh, maybe they're in a different box. Let me look around. Well, after some looking around, I, I found them. They were, they were right here the whole time. There's, here they are. Hmm. So there's two of them they use. Yeah, it was right there. I was actually looking around for a little bit and I'm like, okay, there's two circles here. But, so I believe that is everything here. More antennas. This is one of the controller boxes. Which we're gonna have to read up on and see how all this goes. But it is unboxed and there's the deal. 
here's how many plugs it has. It does come with the ram mount. I seen the other piece for it somewhere around here, but yeah. So good thing there's a good sized book for this because we gotta figure out where all this stuff goes. So the steering was pretty decent actually. But well, we're going to have to get to work here. Uh, check my next video out. We're going to be installing this. I have to pull the steering wheel. That's probably been on there since 1982. So we'll see how that goes.